Since Thursday, four people have died while climbing Mount Everest, the world's tallest mountain. One was Maria Stridham, a finance lecturer at Australia's Monash University. She and her husband, Robert Gropel, were on a quest to climb the tallest peak on each of the seven continents, and in the process, proved their vegan diets didn't affect their climbing. In an interview posted on the Monash Business School website, shortly before the couple left to climb Everest, Stridham said, it seems that people have this warped idea of vegans being malnourished and weak. By climbing the seven summits, we want to prove that vegans can do anything and more. More than a month into their climb up Everest, the Sydney Morning Herald reports Stridham died from altitude sickness after reaching the final campsite, which is about 1,300 feet from the mountain summit. Gropel also suffered from altitude sickness, but was taken down the mountain by sled to a base camp where rescue helicopters flew him to a nearby hospital in Nepal. He is expected to recover. BBC reports almost 400 people have reached Everest peak so far this year. Climbing routes on the mountain were closed in both 2015 and 2014 after several natural disasters claimed the life lives of both climbers and Sherpas. According to CNN, Stridham and Gropel had already climbed four of the seven continents' highest summits before their Everest climb, including Africa's Mount Kilimanjaro and Denali in Alaska. For Newsy, I'm Catherine Beek.